Oh hi there big boys, welcome to Red Matter. This is some sort of adventure game in VR. Oh It's got subtitles, lovely. In our institutions, among us, stripping us of our secrets. It's this is some sort of prologue thing. Rockets once aimed toward the sky, now point farther still into space. Oh my. To infiltrate the complex, uncover the secrets of their research, and transmit them to headquarters. Do you like these graphics so far? Do you like the story? Kind of wish there was a bit more interactive, but there we go. Okay. Good luck. Nice. From what I can tell, this game seems pretty similar to Lone Echo in the way that it's sort of an adventure game where you sort of have loads of different mechanics where you sort of just spam into one big story, which is good to me. I like that. Question is, I'm a bit concerned about the fact we haven't moved yet. So, hopefully that's just for the... this bit. Uh, uh yes. I do like... I do, oh god. Uh oh. This probably was not uh, as planned. These graphics are quite pretty, especially for VR. Um, what do, what do we do? Um, uh, er, do we? Um, mm, mm. Okay, okay, fire pit. Hmm, I don't think that went very well. Oh my. Ooh, this is not a bad looking game at all. Whoa, error. Okay. Oh, right. So, okay. Alright, I pressed it. Oh, wow. This is quite cool. I like how they've made the Oculus Touch controllers actually fit into the game. That's clever. That's very clever. Okay. You can make porting to a to Steam or PSVR very difficult though. Be careful about that, devs. Don't know if they even want to. Maybe it's a. I mean, I know it isn't exclusive as of now, but. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. How does that work? That's a bit weird, isn't it? Hmm. Anyway, uh, okay, I will point at the trigger. No, I won't. Oh, they don't actually mean a sign, they just mean the signs. Okay. Got it. Use this tool to scan the sign by pressing the trigger. Oh, I did say scan the sign. I'm scanning the sign. Oh, pull the trigger. For some reason, I'm still looking at that because of the. I'm a dimwit. Okay, there you go. Oh, there we go. Do, 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 do. The what? Okay, so what do we do? Okay, how do you walk around? I got that. How do we move? Or do we not? Oh, there you go. Hmm. Uh, ah, uh. okay, um, look around for it, I don't know what I'm looking for, oh, there you go, locate the thing. Alright, I need you to reload the Volgravian basic language data drive, so we can translate that sign. How do you reload that? Probably have to look around for it. It well, be close. it's probably here, but then how do we, how do we use it? Oh, wait, here we go, wait, that's just a weird logo. Do we, do we eat it? <laughs> Um all right. I need you to reload the Volgravian basic language data drive so we can translate that stuff. Yeah, okay. I've, You'll probably have to look around for it. I've got it. Then what do I do with it? I don't get that that's the problem I've got here. Maybe throw it at the sign. Probably not. Um all right. I need you to 
Oh, we just scan it. Probably. Yeah, there we go, scan it. Okay, that makes more sense. I do apologize, I'm like a right ram. Maybe I've done too much programming today that my brain's gotten confused. Ooh, uh, I will do. Yeah, it's kind of odd how it doesn't really go into the direction you thought it would, or think would you would think it would at least. It doesn't really go forward; it goes downwards. Hmm. But then I guess the idea is so you can see that. Yeah, that's probably is. That's fine. Oh no, my controller's running out of charge. Ah. Um. What the hell? How is it? Okay. So what does that do? Hmm. Thrusters. Use the navigation system to search for a landing position by moving the stick forward. Once you've found somewhere to land, release it, and the suit's thrusters will do the rest. Wait, so what does this one do? Uh, this is hands. It's like just basic hands. Wait, so then how do I move? I didn't pay attention. Moving the stick? I am moving the stick forward. Hmm. Oh, I see them in the other one. Oh, oh my. Okay, so it's, it's sort of teleportation, but sort of creepy. Oh my, that's weird. That's going to give people motion sickness, I feel. Dunno. Maybe it wouldn't? It doesn't give me motion sickness yet. Wow, that's really good. Wow. My frame rate is starting to dip here, but that's fine because I am recording. Okay. That looks really impressive. Damn. <laughs> Isn't it amazing what VR can do? Okay, let's let's uh, continue onwards, I guess. Ooh, what's that? Ooh, free projection. Okay, I will, uh, I don't know, go over here. What's that? Out of range. Door control, use caution when opening, okay. Remember that your scanner is not only to translate text, but to nope. analyze objects as well. That's what I'm doing. Can I... Oh my, okay. Is there anything over here? What about that? I don't know what that is. Is that just a... Is that some sort of re uh, reflection-based thing? Looks like it is. Okay, it's kind of impressive how it does that. I'm, I mean, that actually suggests it's actually proper reflections. Nice! Anyway. Let's continue. Meow. That's a weird feeling you get in your, in your hands when you do that. Job, Very Edward. creepy. We're okay, we're inside. Good. Okay, I won't do that for now. Oh my god, no, we're stuck. We're stuck, we're stuck, we're stuck. What's that? Some sort of document? Ah. we. Oh, there we go. Maybe just that. Why is that there? Isn't this meant to be some sort of Russian... I'm assuming it's Russian, given all the stuff. Although we're in space, aren't we? So probably not Russia. <laughs> we don't know. Whatever. Okay, good. Uh, my, my, my touch controllers. Good, so we've got that. Which should allow us to read text and the such. But, can we read this now? Datron are uh, prospecting into an underground cave below the base. Okay. Looks to me that we certainly can. Oh. A little bit annoying teleportation. I kind of... Actually... Let's check that. Let's move over commotion. Aha! Okay. Whatever. Um... It, it, it doesn't work. Oh wait, uh, uh, the rift headset's lost tracking. I, I just set it on and it didn't work. Uh, okay, well, you know what we're going to do? I'll be back in a second. I'm going to reset my batteries. Okay, we're back. Now, how do we move using this free locomotion boy? So, off, on. Press any grip button to move forward. You look at such point in the direction you want to move. Okay. I'll press grip button. That's a bit odd. But I guess that oh oh god, so you don't actually control it. You just sort of look in the direction you, you want and press grip. Okay, well that's horrible, but I guess it works. Okay, uh, kind of wish I could use the analog stick, but um, there you go. Let's, oh wait, wrong button. 
There you go. Translate. Okay, there's some stuff. There's some more stuff there. A lab report on the presence of pollutants in the ice. Oh no. Okay, let's go here. Oh my god, that's weird. <laughs> okay. It's weird how... You know, I've, I've, wait, wait, what was I actually doing? I was moving that up. Ah, okay. Um, why is the tra tracking has got so got so bad all of a sudden? Where am I? Okay, I'm gonna I'm in the center of my play space. <laughs> What's the problem, boy? Okay, let's try and do free locomotion. To go up here. Oh, wrong way. Will there be anything up here? There should be, because. This game has been designed with that in mind, I would hope. Okay, let's go. Do, 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 do. Oh my. Some. Oh god. Hmm. That's a bit suspicious. Whoa! What? Why is the tracking so bad? Unless that's just. Is that because I'm holding a heavy item? Yeah, I think it's because I was holding a heavy item. That's a bit odd, but okay. I guess it's to generate a sense of heaviness or whatever. Fair enough. Okay, there's nothing here, so that was weird. Um, unless it's like here. So why would there not be anything there at all? Access loader with damage, so you have to jump onto the gantry directly, comrade Stas. Hmm. Oh, wait. Can I use this? To use as something. Ah! Okay, so now we've got to move this over here, I would assume. Can we get it over here? Oh god, the tracking's really weird. It's really laggy and I don't know why. Like, the game doesn't isn't running too bad. It's, I'm going to turn down the graphics just in case. Oh. It's t <laughs> okay, it's just medium or high. Strange, but okay. See, why is it doing that? What? What is the problem? Oculus trackers. I'm not sure if this is my if a problem with my computer, like something wrong with my game right now. Or it's a problem with the um with the game. It's quite odd. It makes me a little bit. I don't know. Maybe if it's something wrong. I mean, I wasn't getting it beforehand. Oh, I cannot move it down anymore. Can you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna be back in a second. I'm gonna check this as well. This is really weird. Okay, so from what I can tell, it does seem to be a problem with my sensors. Well, rather, my one... Well, one sensor's working fantastic, the other sensor's dead, dying, uh, needing a lot of stim packs, and, um... So I don't know why. So, instead, I'm going to look at this one and never turn around in my life. Apologies to the developers, it's not their fault. Unless it is, because I don't normally get this problem, it's a bit odd, but I doubt it. I don't want to be pointing any fingers. Um, um, what? So I guess they do want me to put it over there. Okay, I figured. I was thinking that, given they're both orange, which sounds silly, but it's not. Uh, anyway, we can't move it downwards anymore, can we? So, actually, what are we doing? Because we can't jump. Actually, can we jump onto it? Oh, yeah, we can. The doy. That's why. That's why uh, free locomotion isn't. 100% supported then. So what is the point of that? What is, how does this help? I mean, I'm on here, which is nice, but... Surely that's just gonna... Hmm. Is there anywhere I can go with this? No? I mean, I can't see anything. Okay, I'm gonna ignore that. Come back down there later. Instead, I'm gonna go down here and see if there's anything here uh, I haven't noticed, which there really Someone will be. Nikolai Maturin and oh, I don't know what I'm doing a silly voice. Oh, the only reasonable names the rest are cur crossed out. Okay, wonder what they've done. Maybe they've uh, killed a president or something. Airlock fuse box. Hmm. Can I open it? Hey, I can. Nice. Good to have interactables. Okay. Hmm. What's this trying to say? Make sure both fuses are connected to open the airlock. Okay. Um, I guess I need some sort of fuse thing. Hmm. 
They're both red, which suggests to me they're not going to work. Then what are they... The oh, what? Oh. How do I do that? <laughs> I didn't even mean to press that button. Oh, there we go. There's the fuse. It's obviously broken. It looks <laughs> yeah. Okay, I can't see that one working. Okay, fine. Wow. Um, right, in that case... What are we going to use? Do you go over there and check over that little box? Um, for what I've heard, this game is a good few hours long, like two, three hours. Pretty good for a VR game. And it's obviously an actual adventure game in VR, which is nice because there's not enough of those. Uh, any of these fuses working? That's a no. Broken fuse. Yeah, I figured as much. Um, so yeah, that's always good. Graphics are real pretty. Optimization is, I mean, it's not badly optimized because it looks, you know, considering what it looks like, it's doing pretty well. And I'm recording. But it is a bit odd how there's not more graphic settings, but um, you know, at least it runs decently well. Uh, anything else to point out? I don't know. It all seems quite high quality, you know. But I mean, obviously, I'm not a huge fan of the um, this sort of weird thing where you just point and do that. The controls are all a little bit odd, but I can understand why I did it. So it's you know, whatever. Um, there we go. What's that? Use caution. Outdoor freezing hazard. I think, I think it has spelt wrong. Um, but okay. Let's scan that. No, can we not scan the TV? Oh, we can. Looks useless. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, anything here? Nope. Anything there? Nope. I don't know what I'm doing. There's nothing there. Okay. We definitely do need to go back up there then. Oh, see, I'm trying to press that button to do the... Uh, it's kind of annoying. Can I break that as well? No. Ooh, okay. Let's go over here. Bring this back down. Oh no. And then do that thing again. Must be something I missed. Can we, can we do that? I think we can do that. There we can. I do like that. Nice. Grab it. Grab it. Okay. What do we do now? Hmm. There's all sorts we could do, although there sort of isn't. I'm a bit confused, really. I mean, we need fuses or something, evidently. But then where are we going to get fuses, considering that they all seem to be broken? But then there's also this, which suggests we've got to use this for some reason. Uh, maybe we can go over there. Let's try going over there. That looks suspicious. So something I could open up and take a look inside. Looks like one of those fuse boxes. Maybe it's a fuse box. Do, 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 do. We're walking along and we see a fuse box. Do, 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 do. Now we try to open the fuse box and see what's inside. It's going to be empty. Ah, we got a fuse box. A fuse, not a fuse box. Okay, that's good. We got one. Do we need. Oh, there's one there as well. I think. I think that's one. I wish you could change in midair which like direction you're going. Okay, good. We'll put this one at first, then we'll do the other one. I know we could just do it with one hand, but I don't mean two hands by switching out the thing, but I don't want to because it's kind of annoying to use that. But instead, we'll just do this. Good. One down. Now, uh, the second one. Well, probably the first one. I thought most people would probably find this one first. Yet somehow I found it last, uh, which is a bit odd. But I guess I'm some sort of crazy man. Do do do. Whoa, careful there. Don't want to get uh, punched in the face. And if, well, at least if I can, you know, help it. Okay. Oh, see, okay, I'm just gonna. There we go. Good. Saving game. Now, does this door now open? Let's find out. It wants me to use both hands. I should have just done it from the fir uh, first time. Okay. Oh, wait. That doesn't work. Is it still locked? Yes, it is locked. I guess? Well, we did that. Can we just... Unless we got a... Oh, wait. There we go. Ah, I see. Okay. How the feedback you get when you do that wrong is quite scary. 
Um, okay. We're inside an elevator. Now, what is inside of this elevator? I don't know. Well, I say elevator. It's, it's a lift, but, um, you know, I say lift because I'm English. Anyway, emergency rotation control cover. Don't know what any of those words mean, but, um, I will use this as a thing. Can I interact with it? No. Can I interact with this? It's a bit like I can. Hmm. Don't know. Oh, tracking's going off. Off. Let's press the snail. Yes, please, please. No, nothing there. Okay, uh, anything here? Um. Well, that's on. No, I can't. Um, airlock pressure control. I guess because it's open, it needs to be shut. There you go. Nice. Hmm. Lovely cables. Very impressed by cables now. Because I know how much annoying work cables are, especially if they move. Oh, they're the bane of my life. Anyway, we're making a VR cable game. Anyway, uh. There we go. Whoop. Oh my. Okay, that was nicely done. And then we probably do this as well. Um. No, we don't. Do we not? It looks like we were meant to grab it. What? Okay. <laughs> They, they do a good job of making the inputs feel pretty good, to be honest. There you go. That was weird. Oh. There we go. Actually doing a little twist. Oh, we did it. Oh, no, we didn't. No, we didn't do it. Oh. That's kind of annoying to do. <laughs> there we go. Oh wow, it's running even better now. Lovely. I guess it was mostly outside areas that died. Okay. Hello. Oh my. It's getting scary now. Okay, we probably won't do too much longer because obviously I can't record for too long. I'm not really sure how long I've recorded. I'm pretty sure we're roughly at 15 minutes now. So we'll do a couple more minutes in exploration. I am liking this game so far. It's nice. Um, it pre I mean, really, controls are... I'm not a bit huge fan of the controls. Like, you know, regarding this, I mean, inputs is, I mean, the in, I don't know, grabbing stuff feels quite good, most of the time, stuff like that, but then my eyes don't really like the controls of doing this, really, it's all a bit, you know, but, um, you know, it's fine. Clearly a lot of uh, work's been put into the game as well, it's nice, uh, and it's, you know, one of the only VR adventure games there is, so I mean, I can't really not recommend it, <laughs> which sounds bad, but, I mean, you know, it's, it's a nice, it's a nice game, I like it. Pretty sure it's made by with Unreal. Pretty sure they said once. So that's cool. I mean, Unreal's a nice engine. Now, I don't like using it myself because it triggers me, but I know it is a good engine. Uh Volgravian spacesuit. Okay, spacesuits. Is that a space lady suit? Oh, it's just a rack. What? Did I scan the wrong thing? Yeah, it looks well, that looks more like a lady's suit for some reason. Don't know why. You know they look the same, actually, just slightly different coloured. Then green isn't really associated with, with, with ladies. I don't know. Um, there you are, sir. Um, the document has become illegible. Oh, that's a shame. Do do do. Open this up. Oh, what's that? Nitrogen tank. Oh no. You don't want to burn that. Oh, is that people's faces? I'm sure that what we've done is just taken a photo and then applied a filter. I mean, I'm not trying to say that's silly. I'm sure that's what most people do when they do stuff like that. Because always like life is strange. It's probably similar. I'll do similar stuff to that. That's cool. Hmm, cats. Picture of a cat. Okay, that's nice. The chess piece. What's a chess piece going to be helpful for? A red king. Why is it? Why is it like that? What? Why is it red? Is that is that like some sort of? Mm, it's really odd. Is that, is that supposed to happen? I, I think it is. Hmm. Can I interact with this? Oh no. It's impressive how you can interact with so much. 
I mean this, what is that? Oh, that's all a bit weird. Okay, I'm going to ignore that and be a bit scared by it. Because I don't know why it does that, all that red stuff. Uh, oh, it's more text I can't read. Turn around. Uh, what's that? Did you do what it read? I really I hope that your death will be at least so that we all... Oh, God. Red parasites? That's not very promising. Um, okay then. Oh, a thing. What's that? Oh, got some more stuff. Okay, what's this? Security codes. Excellent. This is a personnel security code. Now that it's loaded into memory, simply use the scanner to activate it. I will do. What's that? Code of a color. For, please report your. Hmm. Very odd. Lots of stuff here. Look, there's all sorts. We spend hours here looking at all the stuff. She loved the soil, and now the soil loves her. Oh god, that's sad. Okay. It's quite impressive how you can interact with so much. It really is. You honestly can tell that they put a lot of work in this game, and I do appreciate the fact that they made it, to be honest, because they need more VR stuff. Uh, okay, is it open? No. What's that? Is this? Oh, it's a lift. Oh, wait, this is the lift we just went into, isn't it? Oh, wait, it was, no, there's one there. So we got the scanner thing. Can we now... Hmm, what's in here? Ah. Uh, some text, that's nice. Elevate blocked use your credentials at scanner below. Well, I've already got those, so that's fine. There we go, use that as security code. Now locate the security area. The documents we're after should be there. Remain alert. There's no telling what we may find down there. Oh no. Well, that's, this is a, a better play. Well, uh, well, hmm. this is a good place, if any, to turn off the record. Oh, specialist is now loading. Uh, yeah, it's a good time to turn off the recording and end the video. So, what would you? What would I rec Would I recommend this game? Yes. There you go. Um, I mean, it, oh god, it's getting a bit creepy now. I can hear noises in the back of my head. Oh god. Oh no. Oh. What was that? The power Is this game turning into horror now? Oh god. Oh god. Um. Oh no. Okay. So, this is, um. Look at the. That looks impressive. Anyway. Yeah, this game is, um, it's an interesting one. You can get on Oculus or probably other stuff eventually. Probably. Um, it's pretty creepy. It's pretty good. Uh, controls a little bit finicky, but there we go. Um, the graphics are pretty good. Optimization is pretty solid. The story seems pretty good. Uh, voice acting seems fine. And it is getting to be a become, a, well, getting to become a bit creepy. Look at this. I don't, I, Oh god, I mean, I sort of don't want to keep it a secret, so all of the people who are watching have to play the game to find out what's over there. What is over there? I can always the light bulb was a bit stronger, but um, that's, that's weird, I mean why, I don't know, is this game going to turn into a horror thing, or is it going to turn, just, is this just trying to be a bit creepy, a bit of a tense atmosphere, don't know, I mean, the fact that they've just put so much detail in the game, you've got to try and support the dev, so um, yeah. So thanks for watching me boys, it's that point in time, and bye! bye, bye, bye.